Hey, I'm Jenny. Hey, I'm Liz. Welcome back to Handmade. We have gathered here today to honor the patron saint of waffles and lady friends, Leslie Nope of Parks and Recreation. <laughs> but seriously, guys, Galentine's Day is coming up. What's Galentine's Day? Oh, it's only the best day of the year. Every February 13th, my lady friends and I kick it breakfast style. The three most important things in life, according to Leslie Nope, are friends, waffles, and work. Or waffles, friends, work. The first two are interchangeable. Work is always third. We're gonna mix it up a little bit. We've made these adorable waffles on a stick. We're gonna put chocolate on them and put sprinkles and all sorts of fun things and then tie them up and be able to give them as gifts to our friends. It's going to be adorable, so let's get started. Waffle maker, candy melts, short wooden skewers, cellophane bags, ribbon, gift tags, decorations like sprinkles or crushed up cookies, waffle mix. Okay, so the first thing we're going to need is some waffle batter. This waffle batter? That waffle batter. So we're using a uh, mix today just because we're keeping it simple. Now add the waffle batter to your waffle maker. We're adding about two tablespoons of mix into each square waffle. We want it to stay kind of circular and irregular around the edges. You don't want your waffle pops to get soggy, so we're gonna let them get extra crispy in the waffle maker. Those look so crispy and delicious. Oh yeah, oh they are, perfect, crispy. Well, you know, friends don't let friends serve soggy waffles. <laughs> this is totally true. For this project, you want your waffles as crispy as possible. This will help them stay on the stick and they can also be packaged and given as a gift. Yeah, so we're going to pop these into the oven at 250 degrees while we make some more waffles and then we're going to decorate. So these are some short wooden skewers. We're using the sharp end to put into the waffle. This is what makes them into pops. So we have the cutest little waffle pops. They're so adorable. I think we're ready to decorate now. I'm so excited. This is by far the most fun part. So we have three different kinds of colors of melted candy melts and lots of sprinkles and some crushed up cookies. This is the part where you just let your creativity shine. Your drizzling technique is on point. Oh, thank you, man. Okay, so now we're gonna flip them over and decorate the other sides. Lots of chocolate for each waffle. We are not being stingy here. So we just need to let these uh, dry completely and then we're gonna package them up. We're going to package these in some cellophane bags. And tie them up with some cute ribbon and add some gift tags. All right, so I'm just gonna trim up the cellophane bag just to give us a little less overhang. Do you want me to cut some ribbon for you? Yes, I would love that. Teamwork. Makes the dream work. I'm sure Leslie Nope talks about teamwork somewhere. Oh, for sure. That's adorable. Oh my gosh. Jenny is adding some gift tags. She has the best handwriting of anyone I know. I think that's um, about 60% of why I have a job here, actually. Did you know that? <laughs> 60 to 75%. 60 to 75%. Your winning personality is obviously part it's, of it, too. It's like five, a solid 5%. Gosh, these are the cutest, and I cannot wait to give them as gifts. Oh my gosh, so cute. And you know, in the words of our patron saint, Leslie Nope, it will help us avoid salads and other disgusting things. At least for this one day. Just one day. <laughs> well guys, it has been super fun. Now that you know Valentine's Day is a major holiday, we wanna know how you're gonna celebrate. Yeah, so let us know in the comments below, and don't forget to give us a thumbs 
up and subscribe to the channel for more amazing videos like this. And we will see you next time. soft. I use a different recipe to make a ha my houses, which I will send to you. Let's just do cracker houses. I just wanted to like... Okay, the first thing you'll need is waffle batter. Oh, shit! <laughs>